Good morning. I realize it's been a long time since I posted an unboxing video. Um, I just went through neck surgery last week. Uh, had a disc replaced. So, been kind of out of commission for a little while with that. But here we go. Figure I better get a few of these filmed up before I go back to work. So, here we go. This box is for a girl 10 to 14. And this is in a llama theme. Um, it is bulging a bit because of one of her wow items that's right on the top. But it is a squishy item, so the box will compact over time, I'm hoping. Um, my husband was teasing me about the five rubber bands. That was his idea. I don't know that it needs five, but see, it works with three. Um, doo -doo -doo. So I did a series of girls 10 to 14 all animals so i had llamas butterflies horses sloths uh oh gosh what else did i have elephants panda bears it was kind of fun um just because i had a lot of animal animal stuff around so here we go there we go you can see what i mean when she opens it up there is a very squishy pair of llama slippers on top the slippers took up a good deal of room, so I didn't have room in this for a shirt, which I usually put, but I figure this is, this is good. They're cute. Got a little cardboard on there. I might have to clean that up a bit. Or is that glitter? Oh, I think it's glitter from the other pair of shoes that was in the box. And I wrote, Jesus loves you inside the lid. All right, and then here's what's underneath. Okay. So she has her stuffed llama. Isn't he cute? He's so brightly colored. I love it. Um, oops. Got a tag on the tag. I didn't see that. I'll take that off. Uh, so this was a thrift store find part of a collection. Um, I got quite a few that day. No smell. No nothing. All good. So he's very adorable. Just a little globe stress ball. Um, I ordered these various places. I don't like this size as well. Dollar trees are much larger. Um, I think I'll go back to getting them from them. Although these are about half the price. Uh, they're just a fun little addition. It's kind of fun to have a globe. School supplies. I'm out of scissors right now. So she does not have scissors. But we've got glue sticks. Sorry, my cat's playing with a bottle cap in the background. She's kind of annoying. Some washi tape. Uh, she has a llama uh, sharpener. I almost said eraser. It feels like an eraser, but it's not. And then we've got some other fun things in here. We've got a multicolored click pen. Um, just some fun extras for the big kids. Try to put in interesting things like that. There's some shaped erasers, and then there's a regular eraser in the bottom. A bunch of pens and pencils, uh, blue and black pens. I don't have any red right now. She's got some decorative pencils. There's some hearts and butterflies and Frozen and Minnie Mouse, and then there's some regulars. So lots and lots of pens and pencils. Um, on purpose. I get pens and pencils here for three to five cents each, um, and that's just so much less than it costs to get them overseas. Um, my cousin runs an orphanage in Uganda, and he says the pencils that we get here are actually a higher quality than what they can get there, too, also. So ours tend to last longer. Just a fun pouch. Pick the colors because it matches the llama. It's just got some extra stuff in it. Um, this is from Hobby Lobby. Recent find here in September of 23. Uh, we've got some dental floss in there, a little poppet toy. I don't know why I picked the pineapple. Uh, nail file. And then also in here we have a whole bunch of stickers. There's a bunch of llamas and... Bible verses. I just get these online. I get like 50 at a time or 100 depending on the pack. 
so I went through, like I said, I was doing several girls' animals once, so I went through the animal in the Bible verse stickers and picked out a bunch for her. All right, continuing in the llama theme, she has a cross-stitch kit with all the instructions and the hoop and everything. No problem, llama. I don't know if she'll put the words on it, but the llama's cute. Um, I love doing cross-stitch when I was a teenager and a kid. My kids like doing it too. Uh, llama mirror. This one opens up. Um, it is a plastic mirror and because it has the cover, it's good. It also has a little kickstand so you can stand it up. Um, this was from Christmas at Walmart two years ago. I'm almost out of them. Uh, they had llama sloth and unicorn, I think was the other one. Got a game, four in a row. Uh, another little squish toy, just because. He's not llama. He's just there. Uh, llama pop-out pack coloring kit. These are, I get these at Dollar Tree when I really want a theme item. They've got a few different ones. You can always find there. A couple of note cards with envelopes. Oh, that one's backwards. Just because. Um, I got a lot of stationery from Hobby Lobby and it's kind of breaking it up between sets. So um, these girls got a couple cards, three cards each. Uh, some socks and underwear. The socks have a space llama on them. Isn't that funny? He's got this little astronaut helmet. And then just plain underwear. I think these are 16s. Large, whatever large was. Probably 16. She has a journal. No drama, llama. This was another Hobby Lobby. It's just nice lined, kind of a heavyweight waxed paper. Oh, another price tag. I tend to take off price stickers for the residue, but just because. Oh, more llama stuff. We got a Little llama activity pad, a llama bookmark. There's a llama coloring book. Um, Dollar Tree, I believe, because it doesn't have a tag on it. I'm guessing it's Dollar Tree, not Dollar General. Colored pencils. Let me get the rest of this out. Back that up. All right still see him. Okay then here in the bottom of the box I've got a picture of myself with a note on the back. A toothbrush. I don't always keep them in packaging but since this one was individually packed I went ahead and left it. Um, I don't really mind if they're open because I figure they're gonna rinse it. <laughs> I always rinse my toothbrush first. Hey, we're good. Um, some stickers. Notebook. I just went with purple. Just because. I like purple. Purple's good. Uh, some giant stickers. Uh, this must have been Hobby Lobby. But there's sloths, but on the back there's also a llama and a panda. So this one, several of my gal's boxes. And then she has a little pouch, organza bag, uh, jingle bell just cuz, pair of earrings, a hair scrunchie that matches her llama, and then a nice necklace, it's kind of gold rope. Walmart had these multi-packs, four necklaces on a card for a dollar this summer. So I have a bunch of those that I'm sending to the big girls. So that's her jewelry. Try to send jewelry to all my uh, 5 to 9 and 10 to 14 girls. Just because it doesn't take up much space and I can get it uh, relatively inexpensive. And I think they like it. So, there we go. A llama box for a girl age 10 to 14. So if you have any comments or questions, please feel free to leave them below and thank you for watching.